Hello everybody, Happy New Year. Um, just doing a little quick vlog really, nothing too fancy today. Um, I've got a new project which I'm going to be hitting tomorrow hopefully, which is this one. I've got given this old axe and I want to repurpose it, so I'm going to make a hatchet from this one. So I'm going to start the video for this tomorrow um, and then hopefully next couple of days will be up. Also, just thought you might be interested, I've got this little project that my daughter and me are making. She's a trainee chef and she wants a new kind of knife, so she's making this one. And we're going to video that because I thought it might be a bit interesting. Um, something else I've done, which you might be interested in, I like repurposing stuff, you probably know that now. I had an old chopper I've had for years, just sat around doing nothing and it was all beat to pieces the end of the blade was snapped off so i thought i'd restore it and there we are so the guys if you follow me on facebook or insta you would have seen this but if you don't follow me on facebook and insta and then you'll see more updated stuff that i do but there we go so you can see it's um i've just given it a i think it's 120 grind on there look nothing too fancy because it's going to be used i hope it's got an Iroko, which is a very hard wood handle there with, uh, I can never pronounce it, is it Mokum Gain? Mokum Gain? It's something we made, a friend of mine and myself made it. It's copper with nickel and you forge it together and it's pretty damn cool. And then to top it all off, I made a walnut um, handle on top. And this is all threaded and that's the original ferrule which sticks on there. And then I've just put an amazingly wicked edge on it. So it's going to be an ideal kind of kitchen chopper, something like that. So, yeah. Oh, let's, should we do ourselves a little, um, what are they called, a little thumbnail? Oh, something like that. How's that? That'll do, won't it? So, yeah, that's what we're doing. And also, another one I'm doing, see, I do a lot of this kind of stuff, and I post all this up, so keep following. There we go. This, I've got given. Um, it was an old, obviously it's an old cleaver, a butcher's cleaver. But I did a bit of hist history on this one, a bit of research. And this is Braids from Old Brain, Birmingham. Now, they started in the 17th century, but I'm guessing this is probably Victorian. So, you know, 100, 150 years old, but, and it's still, still rocking. And um, the only sad thing was that it was only one side of the, of the scale which was on there. So I thought I'm going to rehandle it. So we're going to sort it out. I'm going to put a new handle on it. You can see it's, I think this is a forged blade. Um, sorry, cast, I mean, a cast blade as far as I'm aware. So I'm going to put a new handle on this one. But I'm not going to do anything else to it. It doesn't need it, does it? You know what I mean? You don't want to ruin a patina. So there we go, guys. So that's basically about it. Very quickly, just to let you know that I am doing another vid, um, a new project. Also, I've got some Damascus I want to kind of crack on with if I can. And I'm just trying to think, actually, if there's any more projects I've got going on at the moment. No, I'm doing it. Oh, that's better. I've got a bit nice there. Um, so that's about it. Let's say only very quickly. Um, I hope you've had a, a good Christmas and a happy new year. Um, take it easy. Oh, oh I forgot. I just want to show you that. See that? My new phone stand I made. <laughs> I was fed up with just chucking my, my phone on the, um, on the bench. So I thought I'd make a new stand. So that works quite well. Anyway, there we go. So take care, everyone. Uh, Happy New Year to you. And I'll see you in a couple of days' time with a new video, hopefully. And in the meantime, as usual, keep safe and well. And I'll see you soon.